Welcome back guys to this final section of this course. So this is about using mockups to embed your designs. So there's this site, freepick.com. I believe all of you guys know it. So I'm just going to search for mockup on this site. This is going to bring up and I'll select PSD. So that to bring up only PSD phone mockups for me that I can edit in my Photoshop. So I'm just going to go through it. You can go through it, choose whichever one you want, but I'm just going to go for the third, the first one I saw and I'll click the down button. Once that's done, it's just going to download it and I'm going to go copy the copyright for stuff I need to use it to do. Then once that's completely downloaded, I just export the zip and open the document in my Photoshop and I go ahead to embed the design, the Instagram mockup design we just made in our previous videos. So just give this a little time. It's just going to download. And once it's downloaded, we just move onward to the next section. Sorry about my internet speed, but I think it's done already. Yes. So that's done. So I'm just going to click that. It spots it for me. I double click it. Yes. The PSD file it opens up in my Photoshop document, my Photoshop software. Sorry. I mean, yeah. So once that's done, just let that to load my complaint for some fonts. Okay. It didn't. That would double click the graphic, which is basically the first things where you can embed your design. I'll drop my mockup design, bring it here, embed it. Yes. And click enter. So for this, I'm just going to off this and trim the layer. So this transparent layers left and right will be cropped out automatically by the software. And once I save that, you're just going to see our mockup is going to appear right here in the, in our design is going to appear right here in the mockup. So basically, um, I don't know why that mockup didn't lay out well, but what I'm just going to do, I'm just going to control T and resize this. I'm just going to resize the, the, the design, save it again go back to the mockup. Okay. Yes. It's looking better. Mind you, you can use any mockup you want. So I'm just going to save this as a PNG. Yes. I'm just going to name it in our download file. I'm just going to name it to iPhone mockup. So I'll save that. It's a large file asset. Once that's done, you see double click. Okay. Still saving. Still saving. Yes. I think it's done now. So when I double click it, double click it, you see the mockup. See you guys in the next video.